Still umbilical. Give me a thumbs up if they're disconnected. I don't, they're still connected. Felix, disconnect the oxygen hose. That a boy. All right, stand up. Keep your head down. Release the helmet tie down strap. Start the cameras. And our guardian angel will take care of you. Well, that's very, very reassuring what we've seen there. A high speed drop, and now you can see from the little dot, there's the applause. You said something. Can't Family applauding, but you can see by the little dot that he's in controlled descent. Two minutes into free fall. So two minutes. Keep talking, Felix. Keep talking. Still can't quite make that out, but reassuring to hear his voice. And you can see how he's in control there. That's showing you the supply of oxygen in his oxygen bomb. Yes, Felix, I hear you. Go ahead. Roger, go ahead. Go ahead, Felix, I hear you. Go ahead. Still three times. Really stable. You fall in three and a half minutes. Record is. Yeah. 
So you can understand that. He said his visor was fogging up, but he's getting to warmer altitudes. There's the shoot. There's the shoot. Under parachute now. Could have done better myself. There's, there's from the out of the north under canopy, and you can contact floating safely, floating safely down to earth. There's Ava Baumgartner. The winds out of the north, five to ten. Give my Elated. Call. Tears of joy from Mission Control. As Felix now approaches the ground. Here are the winds here are out of the east at about ten to fifteen. So, so we're we're now at six thousand feet. This is Mission Control. Felix's current altitude under the chute is 6,600 feet. So he has the highest jump. We can't find you. The temperature didn't work. There he is. There's a closer, sh closer shot from the helicopter. Felix, the wind's out of the north, 5 to 10. Beautiful oh, shot. I think that fits all. Anybody can hear it. I think that fits all. Okay, the wind's out of the east. I somehow I'll give you the wrong information. Out of the east. Oh, you're really close. Cool. Come into your way, buddy. There we are, buddy. Pretty good. Watch your hands. Okay. Felix, wind is out of the east. The wind is out of the east. Under parachute, you have quite a bit of control by pulling those. Wind's out of the east, Felix. Wind's out of the east. By pulling those cords, he can control a fair amount of control on his path into this landing. Now we see that scrub earth below. Felix's altitude is 5,800 feet. Just 5,000 feet now, so really nearing and the altitude out there. I'm not sure of the altitude on the ground. Hey, don't talk to the Don't talk to the clear. Luke's making a call to drop smoke, Felix. That means to drop a smoke marker from one of the helicopters. So here we are. We're in oh, he wanted to see ice. He wanted the smoke so he could see the wind direction. Felix, the wind is coming from the ridge. The wind is coming from the ridge. No, towards the ridge. Pat Thompson, the technical director of the Red Bull Status Program, telling him that the wind is coming from the direction of that ridge I was talking about. So he certainly got the highest jump mark that he was asked to. We'll find out about the mock 
Did he break the speed of sound as he hoped? Here he's coming. And there you can see by the approaching shadow, he's just about there, and he's down the air, safely back. Down on his knees, what a shot. So he has the new record. Control shows recovery crew is at this Felix's location. Also, Mitch Control shows uh, the balloon has been cut from the capsule and the capsule is on its descent. So in there fast, he has the world's record now for the highest jump by far. Successful after all this training, all this work, all this time, there is the capsule being lowered. It has been cut away from the balloon. It's parallel. Parachute deploying automatically, and the capsule comes down to preserve the data and the pictures that are there. There's family celebrating. This is bounded out to the east of Roswell. Yeah, we have unofficial word there on some of those those statistics. It was a four minute, and this was unofficial as they got an ignition control. Four minute and 22 second drop in free fall. So that would not break the Kittinger record for that. Would not break the record for the elapsed time of the free fall. And we'll see, we'll see, did he break, break Mach? Those, Those were speeds, speeds up in the 700 mile an hour mark. mark. So, so I, think I think that's unofficial, that's unofficial and, and calculated, calculated a bit differently than the instrumentation aboard his pressure suit. But that looks like he probably broke Mark. Mach, excuse me. But we'll see. That has to wait. And he broke and he the broke record, the as we mentioned, for the, for the highest man balloon flight. flight. So after, so after some, some tense, tense moments, moments, the issue the in issue flight with the visor, 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 which was successfully was resolved, resolved. There you have it. Aerospace history has been made today. Austrian pilot and parachutist Felix Baumgartner has done it. Made Red Bull Stratus mission to the edge of space a part of the record books. A successful climax to years of careful planning and development. Along the way, there were setbacks, snags in development of the equipment, weather delays, but today, today Baumgartner and the Red Bull Stratus, Stratus team are celebrating. Celebrating, celebrating, celebrating on the ground, on the ground there at the scene now. now. More, More celebrations will follow here at Mission Control. Control. So we're so still awaiting we're still final, final confirmation, confirmation, but unofficially, unofficially new world, world records have been set for the highest free fall ever, ever, the fastest free fall ever, ever, as well as, as the, the highest, highest ever manned balloon flight. And today was also a big win for science, as the Red Bull Stratos team collected valuable data that could ultimately help improve the safety of space travel and enable high-altitude emergency bailouts from spacecraft. The coverage doesn't end here. For more updates, including reaction from Baumgartner and the team, we encourage you to visit redbullstratos.com. So for now, this is Robert Hager, 
saying so long from Roswell, New Mexico. Speed of sound as he hoped. Here he's coming. 